When I looked back at working in the White House, I realized I had been through three phases while I was there, and they were three phases that pretty much everybody went through. First phase, you're brand new, you are lucky to be there. You see all these people, from people you see on Meet the Press on Sunday, to people who just look like geniuses or really brilliant people. They are big people, they have significant jobs, and you know you just got in here by a fluke. You're lucky, keep your head down, don't let anyone know how stupid you are, do your best. I'm admitting to you that there are things I do not know. And I'm telling you that I don't think anybody would have any trouble imagining that there are things you do not know. That's phase one. Phase two is you've been there for maybe a year. You've done some work. You've gotten to know people. You've gotten to understand the plant and how things work. You have some friends. And you realize, you know what? This is the great blessing of my life, but I, I think I feel equal to these people. Let me see if I have this. A hurricane's picked up speed and power and is heading for Georgia. Management and labor are coming here to work out a settlement to avoid a crippling strike that'll begin at midnight tonight. And the government's planning a siege on 18 to 40 of its citizens, all the while we host a state dinner for the president of Indonesia. Yeah, you, you got, got it. it. That's phase two. Phase three, you all of a sudden know everything and you realize how frail we are, how imperfect we are, how half dumb or fully dumb we are, and you think, oh my God, we're running the country? So what time is it in Tokyo? Yeah, 14 hours ahead. I thought it was 13. Houston Daylight. So it's 14 hours ahead? Yes. We're sure it's ahead and not behind? Guys, the clock's on the wall. Okay, so it's almost 11 o'clock in Tokyo. Yes. Ginger, this is not...